Morning. Morning. We're off to the National Motorhome and Campervan Show at the East of England Showground today. It's got a goodie bag and it's really exciting. I've got Zaflora in my actual fla favourite flavour. <laughs> smells like fresh linen, fresh washing. We've got eye vitamins, sanitizer, and some some uh, booklet. We've already eaten the snacks, so I can't sh show those to you, but they were really good. It's really exciting because we've just spotted Darren, who's a friend of ours, and he did our recent new screen. You here? You here with all your screens? It's fantastic. Here with the masses. The masses. It's been a busy, busy show. It's been very good. So there it is, guys. Rainbow screens. Go get over there. <laughs> I'll get a hat. Keep the sun off me. How do I look? <laughs> yeah, not bad. This gentleman's hand carving some leather. She's in here shopping again. What? What you bought? Like nothing yet. <laughs> Just having a little taste. It's a traditional fruit liqueur yeah. at 30% fruit. What flavour should I try? What's your favourite? Yeah. Well, mine is the mixed berry or the slow mm. spice plums, the Victoria plum. Um, it's 10 o'clock in the morning, love. It's a, and you're it, having a drink already. Just a, it's a taste. It's, it's right organic time. and it's one of my five a day. And it's the right time somewhere in the world. Yeah. I'm a little bit worried this might be a bit strong, so. This is the sour cherry. Oh my goodness. Oh, really that's delicious. It's really smooth because it's organic. Don't know where it went. We've just found John who does caricatures and he's been doing it for. We can't pin down exactly how many years, but he's been doing caricatures for a long time and we're loving the, the work he's done. John, how can people get hold of you? Uh, lots of ways. Instagram, Facebook, yeah. website. It's John Elson Cartoons and Caricatures. <laughs> Very easy to find. I send them all over. They go all over the world, to be yeah. honest. Really? This, digi this modern digital age. Yeah, draw cartoons on the big art tablet, the stylus, files, and they go all over the world. But I do like the live, face-to-face -face interaction. And it's back, isn't it? I was say, <gasps> oh, I really have, yeah. yeah. What are you found now? Cheese. More food. Caramelised red onion. onion. Caramelised onion, red wine and brandy. Red wine and brandy. I'm going to be trolleyed by 11. Would you like a piece of cheese, Steve? Sure. Mm. Why not? Thank oh, you very hell. much. There we are, buddy. Oh. oh my god. That is... It's nice and rich and creamy. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> Uh, that's our uh, smoked red pepper and garlic. It's a little bit like a pizza base, that one, especially if you melt it on some toast. The creaminess. Okay, I'm thinking of Daz for this particular cheese. It's called a fizzy flamingo, and it's Wensleydale with Prosecco and raspberry. Oh, wait, it's fizzy. Well, not quite fizzy, but... Ooh, the texture on that. Mmm. It's light and fluffy, is it? More samples. All right, I'm gonna have one with lots of filling because we prefer the veggie ones. Yeah, please. veggie, yeah. Mm. Food good. again. Mmm, mmm, really good. Hello. Hello again. Did you bring your daddy? Into. You don't need him anymore. That's okay. All right. 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 Nice to meet you anyway. <laughs> Lovely to meet you guys. You. See you later. Hi, how are you? You're old Christy. What are you eating? Been eating rusks. Rusks? Eating and wearing. Oh. Just the two of you today. Yeah. Oh, boys day out. Children. This is <laughs> a bit different to your builds, these ones, Liam. A little bit different, yeah. No? Uh, given that I use real wood. <laughs> We've just found the Brit Stops um, stand. We've been using them for years, but I'm going to let... What's your name, sir? Steve. Steve, give us a quick potted... What are you? So, Brit Stops is a motorhome stopover scheme based around a book full of over a thousand country pubs and farm shops. 
vineyards, breweries, museums, cafes that will allow you to stay overnight in your motorhome. Yeah, they're not campsites, so you don't get uh, shower blocks or overnight toilet facilities, uh, but what you do get is somewhere a bit different to stay the night and uh, you've saved your campsite fees, so hopefully that money gets spent over the bar or in the farm shop. My dad rang me last week, the week before, he was with a friend who has uh, just upgraded his motorhome and they were looking at getting this and asked me what I thought and I said, yeah, definitely go and get it, give it a try. We've just met Jackie. Jackie, tell us about your club been around over 60 years all run by volunteers and we have over 500 rallies or events each year all over the country once you remember go to any of them and in a normal year you just turn up and enjoy and how much is membership if you join at the show it's 35 pounds and you get yourself a free backpack at this show on a normal year it's 36 pounds 75 and that's the motor caravanners club Sounds like a lot of fun. We found the same brownie company that were at the Stratford upon Avon uh, meet last week that Tash spoke to, and they've put samples in front of me, so it's going to be really rude of me not to try one. The first one I'm going to try is the salted. Oh, you see how gooey that is. Yeah. Mm. Oh my goodness. <laughs> how good is it? Mm. <laughs> Stuck to my teeth. <laughs> mm, so delicious. I'm going to have the other one as well. Because that's rude and I don't care. There we go. Oh, that's gooey as well. Is that the double chocolate? Mm. Oh my gosh. Don't ever make me choose. Oh, delicious. Now, what concerns me, ladies and gentlemen, it doesn't stay on the top for very long. Take a look underneath the carpet. By crikey. Um, what's the first thing you reach for when you spill a drink? Another drink. Don't worry about him, he's with Sky. If it's a puppy dog piddle, use your feet. You know, not on the dog, obviously. Look, the stain's gone, I'll do the other side. Here's the good news anyway. If that was the last bottle of 12 year old scotch down there, well, no need to waste it this time. Back in the glass. Couple of fresh ice cubes. Let's face it, Uncle Bill will never know the difference. I'm just kidding, of course I am. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, seeing is believing. Isn't that amazing? The first lucky five to show me 10 pounds right now. Cash or check, there's number one. You be number two. We're gonna double the value. Make it two for one. Two for a tenner, you're in, you're in, you're in. Jump in, the water's warm. This arm battery. Right. Pump. Yeah. Right. All in that there. Oh, fantastic. Plug it in mains, charge it up, take it anywhere. All right. Just like your mobile phone. Yeah. Reception's not very good. <laughs> Fill on my reception at home. <laughs> out of a bucket, out of a battery, you get 75 psi. All the way down to a fine spray and everything in between. You can put warm water, so if you've got kids, uh, animals, dogs, sheep, horses, anything like that, a pop in there. You get five meters worth of reach all the way around your vehicle, plus a metre and a half on the inlet. Now that all comes in that box there. The most compact jet wash in the world. You can get another hoses, jet wash, chunk, everything in there. <laughs> I was just saying how more motor roomy it is than it is campers. You've lured me down here and, under false pretenses. And we've just walked past these campers here. Yeah, let's just not look at them campers. <laughs> let's look at the billions of motor rooms that are here. <laughs> Oh yes, that that is a really interesting thing to tow behind my Land Rover. You don't want a tow thing, no. I reckon a, a tent on top of your Land Rover oh, would be awesome. Oh yeah, yeah. Look at that for a panel gap. <laughs> That's for the Tesla fans. Um, it's a lot of money for a a caravan, a tin caravan really, isn't it? They could have run a bit of filler over and sanded that down, couldn't they? <laughs> 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 they didn't look very aerostream with all those rivets <laughs> sticking out. 57 and a half grand seems an awful lot for a tin caravan, really. Let's go and have a look inside and see why it's that expensive. It's actually very beautiful. Um, I like the dinette area actually. That's nice. It's 
beautiful and it's iconic. Um, would I choose this over a big modern caravan? I probably wouldn't. We doing? A TikTok, Liam? TikToking. I'm a TikToker, aren't I? Not a YouTuber. <laughs> Do us a dance then, Liam. <laughs> it's our new bezies, how are you? Huh? How's the show? Hi. Hey. Have you guys met? I know of him. You know of him. You know of him and Baby Phoenix. <laughs> yeah, I was watching, we were watching your puppy last night actually. Oh. Hello. Baby Phoenix. Baby Phoenix. Just woke up. <laughs> well, we've kind of done yeah, most of the show. Yeah. We're coming back tomorrow. Are you having a drawing done? Yeah. Oh, well done. Oh, right. Huh? Look! Yeah. It's a great subject to draw. <laughs> You're a subject now, are you? <laughs> <laughs> You've been called many things, but not a subject. Hey, baby. Oh, hello. Hi, <laughs> <laughs> Is that his name, Phoenix? Yes, his name. Yeah, I like it. What are all these people doing? Do you understand that? Do you understand that? Do you understand that? Hang on. It's lunchtime, we've pretty much done the show. Um, so we're going to head off and get some lunch with these guys. At the show last weekend, the, the guys didn't have stickers. So, using the power of our business, he's over there. I'm not going to show him yet. You can see it before they see it. <laughs> Bring them over. We've made us some stickers. We've got some stickers. Yeah. You are ready for the big reveal. <laughs> Oh, look at us, look at us, look at us. <laughs> Beautiful. Awesome. I love your logo. Fantastic. It's so cool. Look at that. 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 Look Fully electric. Fully electric. Fully electric. Automatic. Absolutely. Does one gear. For you. Just one gear. Is this one of these what'll drive itself? Yes. Ooh. Oh yeah. You can even catch up with the latest YouTube video in the car. The Roman Radfords. <laughs> we don't watch them, do we, Mazzy? <laughs> <laughs> how's the uh, how's the Tesla experience, Dan? Fantastic. Just feel like I've been on a roller coaster. Not to 16. Yeah. Dramatic. Not quite, not, not two seconds. Incredible. <laughs> Can't get rid of this. <laughs> Double lunch Double date. date. Hey. I don't want anyone thinking I'm going on a date with her. <laughs> You're not. You're dating Steve and I'm dating Lindsay. Oh, well, that's all right. <laughs> Double dating. We've just had a really lovely lunch date with Dan and Mazzy and now we're heading back to the show. We've got a really different feel to this weekend. It feels more like a campsite with a trade show and everyone's getting together and enjoying themselves. Whereas last weekend was more like a festival of all things motorhome and van and conversion. It was a real, real contrast. Here's a tip for you. These events seem to ease off in the afternoon, so it's a bit quieter. We were here this morning and it was packed. Went off for lunch with Dan and Mazzy, came back and, and it's really quite comfortable now. Go and have a look for when we go to Texas and visit our friends. Of course. So this show is a great place to come if you're looking to buy something or if you want to, you know, just test things out. And there's two types of awnings that we found on this particular stand. Um, this is more like the traditional one that we remember, you know, where you used to bash them into the, the sand or wherever you were. Um, but what we've noticed is both types, the other one's um, a blow up one, have got guy ropes 
Now that, uh, I don't know about guy ropes, they worry me. It just seems like a trip hazard. What do you think? It goes under the ammo and then you inflate it to take the, you know, the draft out. Ah. And it seals all the gaps so gotcha. we can get under it. Gotcha. Gentle There you go. Not what you thought it was, no? No. These safari rooms seem really popular at the moment. Um, we know a few people who have them and we know a few people have put them up inside out. Or maybe just one person. Woolly, you know I'm talking about you. None of the big manufacturers are here, but there are plenty of dealers here selling their fifth wheels and their brand new and second-hand motorhomes and caravans. It's really interesting how much different types of van can be valued. This is 57995. The Airstream, the tiny little Airstream that we looked at earlier, was about the same price. You get so much more van for your money, and both are vans that you tow. I can totally see the attraction in something like this. It's, it's such great value for money. For what you get inside, the kitchen's a great size, we've got a dining table, these chairs are so comfortable. Um, I definitely get the attraction. This is the most comfortable size looking bedroom I've seen in anything. Um, I'm really stunned actually. Careful, there's a step behind you. <laughs> it's nearly a chuckle brother moment, I think. Um, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful. And yeah, stunned. Love it. Run out of words. We found some people who want to say hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. What a great channel. Yeah. Press the like button and subscribe. And subscribe. Follow me, Radford. There it is, guys. <laughs>that's it another show's done we've had a lot of fun lovely day yep we had wonderful lunch with dan and mazzy i got phoenix cuddles yeah it was nice bumping into liam again yeah been perfect again hope you guys enjoyed the video see you in the next one